Hello, my name is Mr. Cole, and I'm gonna teach you today this little boy over here. His name is Kim. G. And we're gonna teach him about uh, something called a slope periods. Okay, slope periods. Slope periods is also called uh, direction periods. And the goal of this slope or direction period is to give like a a good representation for a differential equation of what the slope is at each point on a graph. So we're going to do an example here. This one's uh, dy dx equals x plus y. So we're going to do the drawing. Okay, let me get it. So let's do this. Oh, it's on the floor. Okay. So, We're going to start with an example, dy equals over dx equals x plus y. Now, dy dx is a slope, right? We know that because we do the calculus, okay? So now we're going to do the graphing. We do the one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, so what we do, is we take each point, we say like x, y, and then we find the slope out of the point, which is given by this equation. Cha -ching, cha -cha. Wow, so pretty equation. Okay. So, x plus y. So we have for 0, 0, we have a 0 plus 0, because it's x plus y equals 0. So we get this one. And then we're going to do like 1, 0 and a 0, 1, and a 1, 1. So we get a 1 plus 0 equals 1. Uh, 0 plus 1 equals 1, and a 1 plus 1 equals 2. So at a 1, 0, we're going to have a slope of 1, which is like this way. And are you paying attention? Oh my god, you need to pay attention, OK? Don't get a phone until you pay attention. No. OK, so like a 1, 0, we have a also slope of 1. Here. And then here we have a slope 2 at 1, 1. So it looks kind of like this, right? So also, well then we can do like, uh, let's do like a negative 1, 0, and a 0, negative 1. So we're going to get a negative 1 plus 0, and a 0, negative 1. So we're going to get a negative 1 here and a negative 1 here. Right. Yes. Okay. I don't think that's right. But it's actually right. <laughs> if you pay attention close. Okay. So, you do this repeated as a process for all the points. For enough points so you can get a good idea of what what the slope period looks like. So here's going to be like negative 2. going to look like this one right there. And you fill it up, and that's your slope period. Hooray!